Among other key concerns in the housing sector, apart from the shortfall, is high cost of accessing the available ones. The sector is currently plagued by recurring hikes in the price of building materials. This has further made it difficult to address the housing challenge in the country. Salim Ilyas Sugoje, a real estate developer, is lending his voice to, to regularize housing costs. I think government should come in because um, there, is, there is no reason why a landlord should maybe collect uh, 2 million naira as rent as of 2023 now 2024 he's saying that his house has increased from 2 million naira he's now collecting maybe 2.8 million naira mm. so what happened to a common man for example someone that just uh, came into abuja to serve as uh, a youth service copper now you are asking him to pay up to 2.8 million naira you mm. know it's funny you, he cannot or she cannot afford, afford to do that yes so it's something of maybe regularization we should regularize the price then government should uh, provide in their own means housing for their people such a way that maybe houses can be affordable to its citizens salim while speaking on the real estate show a program on boss fm 95.5 abuja noted that to address the problem the federal government of Nigeria needs to partner with the private sector. Of now, there are places that belong to the government. For example, we have Apple Wasa. Mm. But their plan now is to be selling it still to uh, private sectors because maybe they'll bring in 200 million at once. Or mm. maybe they'll credit them maybe 500 million or 1 billion or 2 billion. So it, it, they will get the money, but it is not helping the masses. Salim, however, called for more consideration on the part of real estate developers while fixing property prices in order to help the housing situation, especially in the capital FCT. Klachi Fua, Hills TV, Abuja.